Wanna lie to you, say I'm doing so well Show you photos to the proof that I've been doing so well Wanna hide the truth, wanna dress up hell and heaven like we all try to do I'm scared to call, call, call you back I'm no good, good, good at trying to tell, tell, tell you that I'm not doing okay But I'm dying to hear you say Just take a breath, love, feel your love. Oh, went to Anthony's housewarming party with Nicole. Definitely not my vibe. Or just house parties where I don't really know anyone. Um, yeah, I don't know. I talk to people. I feel like I'm not like that bad at socializing. It's just more like, will I really see these people again? Um... I think it's just reminding me that the summer will definitely be very interesting because I do want to play more volleyball and I'll see, yeah, the people that I end up talking to more. Maybe I'll see more and yeah, it's just like another <laughs> chapter of my life that I don't really know what to expect, but yeah, we will see. Again, it's kind of like one of those things where I don't really try to make a huge effort to talk to people because I'm like, when will I ever see these people again? Or like, will I actually be friends with them? So, yeah, sometimes I'm like, oh, what's the point of me going to these parties? Um, but at least I went with Nicole. And at least I feel like Anthony and I are becoming better friends. And yeah, who knows? Who who knows what's gonna happen? Um, but at least I went. <laughs> ah, yeah, I'm just walking home um, and sleeping over at Nicole's, which will be fun. I'm excited to hang out with her tomorrow. Yay! Okay, I'm gonna walk now. <laughs> Bye. Okay, I'm at Nicole's place and I slept over last night and we're just gonna chill today and I've been looking forward to it like all week so I'm really excited to just hang out with her and relax. I've just been feeling kind of meh for a while now and I'm starting to kind of feel bad and annoyed about it but I know that I should just accept that this is how things are now and that they will pass. It's okay if this isn't like a super happy time in my life or like a super productive time. I think I just need to be more accepting of things and learning that I should just be content with how things are and it is what it is and I know it'll pass and I know things will get better and that's okay. And I think especially this weekend, I've just thought a lot about it because I know like Alex is doing all these things and it's just like triggering me and reminding me of all the thoughts and feelings that I had when we were together and yeah I muted all of his friends um but still like things will just remind me of things and I just want to be over it soon and I think I will be, and I feel like I know that I'm making progress in terms of feeling better about things. I'm just mad that it's taking so long and I know I shouldn't be. <laughs> I wanna try to think of it as like, this is the time that I'm really trying to work on myself and really make progress on the things that I wanna see in myself. And I just have to know that that takes time and there's gonna be growing pains and I'm gonna be discouraged. And right now I feel a lot of just discouragement. And a part of me is like, dang, you think too much about being happy. And as a result, you're not gonna be happy. But I think it's also just important to be reflective sometimes, but also just enjoy what you're doing. And so, yeah, I think this is fine and I shouldn't see it as like a bad thing I should just see it as like I'm making progress and you know you can't have the good days without the bad days so yeah I think I should just be proud of myself for learning more about myself and being more accepting of myself and growing because that's just what life is and I don't want to live a life where I'm just 
not looking forward to anything just trying to get through the day like i want to look forward to things i don't want to just kill time i think what was really getting to me last night and even this morning just like thinking about it was just like seeing alex and his i guess group of friends and me thinking that like i wish i had a group of friends but at the same time like i think i'd much rather kind of spend quality time with like one or two people and not have to be in like this huge group or party setting all the time which is i think what his friends do and it just made me think like when i was in the bay there were so many like group and like events and parties are happening that I like actually like really enjoyed and looked forward to and I'm like why is that not like this now and I think it's honestly just because all of the friends that I had in the bay like it took so much time to like really feel comfortable with them like I spent like years in college with them and like even my friends from like lab or work like I spent years working with them and seeing them every day and I think now it's like with like the pandemic and just like being in a new city making friends like that just takes a lot of time i do think like having friends at work has been nice because you do see them all the time and yeah i don't want to feel like i'm comparing myself to other people and i'm wishing that i had what they had like i do really enjoy all of the people that are in my life and my goal really was just to to find like a good number of people that I really felt like I could be myself with and just spend time with them and I feel like that's what I have done and so I don't know why it's kind of like I'm thinking the grass is greener on the other side where I wish I had I don't know parties to go to or like people who wanted to go out and like go dancing or blah blah, blah. like I feel like I am making progress in finding people who want to do the same things that I want to do and I have like friends that i could just hit up and talk to and really be myself around um i just think it goes back to the balance of like having all of the people that i really like and care about in one place and being able to do things with them but as an adult it's kind of hard because everyone has their own lives and yeah everyone's just like busier the older you get and yeah i think that's maybe like the one thing that I wish I had more of now where it's like all of my friends could get together like the people that I like feel the most comfortable around and then we could do stuff together and maybe that's something that I just have to do on my own or like make happen instead of just wait for it to happen because i remember i got dinner with like anthony nicole yao after volleyball one day and that was so fun like i had so much fun because i just felt like i could be myself and i wish i could yeah make that happen more i don't know i have so many thoughts but i guess last thing i'll say is i think that there are so many different versions of myself and obviously i like some more than others and i want to be the one that i feel like others want to be around but i know that sometimes i will be in these states of like being quieter or more sad or less happy and whatever and i think in the same way I try to like optimize the positive emotions, I try to like shove the negative ones away. I think I need to learn that all of these versions of me are good and I should accept them. And that's just what makes me me instead of, yeah, feeling like I haven't been this one version of myself enough recently. I know that those will come back or like the more outgoing happier whatever version of me will come back and i know like people have seasons and i know in the winter maybe like seasonal depression is really getting to me i don't know but i think i just need to be more content with how things are and know that there are always ebbs and flows ups and downs and again like you can't have the ups without the downs so yeah, I think I just need to get through 
a day at a time, a week at a time, and before I know it, like so much time will pass and I will be like, I feel like learning the whole time, like learning about myself, learning how to, yeah, be more accepting of myself and I don't know, just try to do what makes me happy in the moment and not think too hard about it. I'm really excited for today. I'm gonna go back to editing my vlogs and then I'll meet up with Nicole and we're gonna eat and then I'll see Anthony and then later I'm gonna see Michael and Tony and it'll be fun and then I'm gonna grind at work because I'm leaving in two weeks oh my god ah okay bye